So I didn't install boot camp at all and it looks like the camera program I installed here that thing was supposedly Apple camera 64 so I went here to program files and program files is 64 bits program files x86 is 32 bits and so I found this thing in here called diff x and this was made at 9 11 p.m. So I know this is what the installer did. Let's go into here. And it has this weird little code here. Signature code. DP installer. So this thing is yet another installer. So let's see what this does. DP install. What does this thing do? Yet another device driver installer. Unable to find any drivers designed for your machine. Okay, so what I probably got to do then is change compatibility. Um, troubleshoot compatibility on this thing. It's probably made for Windows 8. So let's see if this thing will fix it and then we can put the driver in. Try recommended settings. There we go. So now it did. This is a Windows 7 program, isn't that something? Next. Test the program. Not sure what that does. Is it testing it? I don't know. But it looks like it looks like the um, Microsoft Pro or I'm sorry, the Apple program for doing this stuff. Uh, bootcamp. It looks like it all kind of quit. So it popped up this window, which not sure why it did that. Can I keep going next here? Yes. Okay, I'm going to say save these settings because who knows? Saving settings. Incompatible program fixed. Well, that's nice, right? Let's close it. Okay, now let's try and run this baby. And see if we can install it here. I want to get this Windows 7 driver working here. Okay, so that's not going to do it. And yet. No. Troubleshoot program. Okay, let's try that. Windows 7. Settings applied, compatibility mode. Test the program. This looks hmm, bad. So it looks like it's not going to go. I open this thing up. What I did see was it popped up that other window here. Okay, what's this stuff here? Um, downloads boot camp. Windows PE driver dollar sign. That was made at 917, so Oh, and look at this. Let's see what this will do. Okay, I think this is still not going to work. Apple Bluetooth, graphics, PCI. 
so those aren't going to go at all. So what else can we do with this thing here? Microsoft drivers, what do these do? BCR, whatever this is. In trouble for Ethernet. Graphic stuff. Huh, seems like ATI. Wonder what this thing is. What does this do? What driver is this for? Blah, blah, blah. Huh. USB something or other. What's this for? USB Ethernet? That's scary. Display keyboard, multi touch, null driver. What if we need that? What's ODD? Remote. Card software update. Gosh knows what that does. I don't want to pollute my computer with too much garbage. I'm just trying to get a camera to work for, you know what I mean? Boot camp installer. Elevated privileges. This is just plain scary. Usually I can elevate this thing by doing a right click and say run as. I don't know. This this seems risky. Boot camp drivers. Here's the cam thing again. Probably never gonna work. Apple Cam, I'm ready to use. Probably for laptop cameras and stuff like that. I could try and reboot the computer, but I don't think that matters anymore. Let's try that out. Let's close up all this stuff. Update not intended, yeah, so I don't think we're ever going to make any progress with this stuff. Restart. I have this thing running on an SSD, so it's super fast. 240 gigabyte SSD. This takes a long time to restart, and that's kind of bad because it's probably chomping on some of that Apple software, which is probably not meant for the computer. Probably jamming it up. Well, there it goes. Let's see what happens this time. Camera's still on. Probably just has power going into it, and that's all there is to it. It's taken a while to come up, so it's definitely, I've probably changed something on here for the worse. I 
I don't want to sacrifice speed on my computer for just a camera. It's taken a lot longer, so it made some changes here. Something made some changes anyway. Wow, this is really interesting. So maybe it worked because look, the camera is now off. How does the camera know it's off? Unless the driver is in there, right? I bet it's working now. Son of a gun. Well, let's bring up cam. Let's see what happens here. Camera. And look at that. It's not saying you didn't find a camera. Yes, it is. I didn't find a camera. And the camera's now turned off. I wonder if I gotta plug the camera out and in again. Maybe we'll give that a try. Let's unplug the camera, plug it back in. It's out, now it's in. And the camera did not light up. That's actually a really good sign that, that it's getting further along here. Let's take a look at device manager. Device manager. Let's see if there's a cam in here showing up. Looks like it refreshed here. Oh, look at that. Now look at that. So we do have a camera showing up. So this exercise was very useful. I'm going to stop the video right here. Okay. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.